Hello everybody, welcome back to Gothic 1. Uh, as you might be able to notice, I got the problem of the sound of my voice fixed. But I'm having some health problems right now, my throat is killing me. I have a real bad throat ache. So I hope uh, you can still notice the difference. Uh, I am in the old camp right now and I am going to uh, report to Thoris and Diego that they finish tasks, tasks for them both. First Thoris, about war drag. He's never going to show his face around here again. I'd have felt happier if you'd killed him. Yeah, I don't really give a shit. Now Diego. I have the list from Ian. Well done. That'll get you a few brownie points. Okay. Take care. Now, um, I'm going to go to the new camp to collect my reward for for bringing the list to Diego. So. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, as I said, I have really bad throat ache. My health's not very good these days, but still, I decided to film this episode because I don't want to skip so long time without uploading anything. <coughs> I was trying to upload an episode every day, but sometimes it just doesn't work. <coughs> okay, this is the place where you can. Uh, the place where you can get a free bow, I said that before, but I did not show you how to actually uh, take it. First I'm gonna talk to Cavalorn here, just for introduction. What are you doing out here? I'm a hunter. Above all, I hunt scavengers. Where will I get a bow? Here, I sell the best bows in the old camp. You must be proud. Um, now, uh, he can teach you how to use bows and also about sneaking. Uh, make sure you loot this chest because there is a key inside. This one, Cavalier's key. Uh, and now, we're gonna go kill this boar. <laughs> And the key we took from the chest opens this door. And that's pretty much your free bow. But I al already have a better one. Because I kill uh I didn't kill him, I bet up uh Shrike in the new cap, so I got his bow which is a little bit better than this one. our way to the new camp to collect our, our reward. There is also a cave up here which I forgot about the last time I passed through here. There are some more rats. I'm gonna kill them for experience. Okay, continuing. Some stone roots here, I can see them from afar. We're gonna go talk to Aiden as well because I did not do that the last time. What are you doing here? 
I'm a hunter. I make a living out of selling skins and teeth. Does it pay? If you know how to cut up the beast the right way, yeah. Uh, he can teach you how to collect animal trophies. I am not. I never waste my learning points on that because I. Unless actually I want to be a hunter or can't every skill. Uh, okay. To the new camp we go. Here we are, our gate guard friends, Some people who welcome with us every time. Now I suggest avoiding lefty, because if you didn't take the water to the peasants he's gonna be really, really pissed and he's gonna want to bash your skull at it, as they say in this game. So I'm just gonna avoid it because I'm not yet strong enough to defeat him. I may be strong enough to defeat him, but if you attack him, the Rice Lord is also gonna join the fight and that can be pretty bad for you. I'm just gonna go talk to Laris. Wouldn't want to be in his shoes, though. Some people never learn. I've given the list to Diego. Good. I positioned some men on the path to the old mine. Thoris's guards are lying dead in the forest, even as we speak. They've already mugged the convoy. Where's my share? Go to see Gorn. He'll give you something. I know Gorn. He's no member of the gang. He's a mercenary who works for the mages. Yeah, that's right. Was he involved in this business? Knowing too much isn't good for you. Just go to see him and collect your share. Uh, by doing this, I just earned my right to join this camp. So I am at this point I am able to join the old and the new camp and pretty soon I'm gonna be able to join the sacked loonies as well. Gord. Shady Why babies. did you take part in one of the gang's raids? Who says I did? Why would you have so much of the stuff if it wasn't true? Don't you think that this is all from one hall? You take part in raids regularly? If I did, I couldn't tell you. Lee wouldn't like that one bit. I see. And see you later. Okay. So, now I've done everything there is to do at this camp. At part, at uh, chapter one at least. So I'm gonna go to the sect camp. There are two more missions that await for me there. Now, I'm not gonna cross the dam because a couple of times I got a lag there. So I'm just gonna cross it over here. I'm hoping to avoid the lag. Great. This is the tenth time, at least, that, I f that I'm uh, taping this episode because a couple of times I encountered the lag I just mentioned, and at one point my mic stopped working, and I filmed like the whole episode, 26 or 7 minutes, and I did not notice that my mic wasn't working. I got really pissed. Really, you can imagine how much. <laughs> anyway, um, let's go to the sect camp. 
and I still have not decided which camp I'm going to join I have no idea each camp has its advantages and disadvantages I guess <laughs> that was a close one uh, maybe I should tell you the advantages and disadvantages so you would know what you when you're making your decision if you join the sect camp it may be one of the best camps but not for me uh, if you join the sect camp you can be half mage half warrior because you can learn and, uh, uh, up to the fourth circle of magic from the gurus and you can also learn fighting skills as a templar so that's pretty cool you can be something like a mage warrior and also there is a big flaw to that camp at least for me and that's the fact that uh, at least I have not found anyone who can teach me the who can teach me the two-handed combat which really sucks ass because the most powerful weapon in this game is actually a two-hander so it's really a big flop I'm gonna take this opportunity I think to to go talk to Hudo I have not met him yet why not it looks as if you knew what you were doing nobody ain't complained yet but that would be a bad idea anyway every idiot here needs a sword and that is what they get from me how long does it take you to make one blade that depends I'm as fast as a hurricane with simple swords of course only on condition that the price motivates me a freak like Whistler usually has to wait longer for his toy than other people. Why? Doesn't he pay enough? No, on the contrary. He gave me 150 or for his last sword. The guy is into ornaments and girly stuff like that, and of course that's not cheap. Hey, you ain't curious at all, are you, pal? Well, Smith, how's business? Why would you want to know? I may have an order for you. Oh, really? And what? I'll think about it. Come back when you really need something, and don't get on my nerves! There are two things in this game that I've never been able to figure out if they're possible. The first one is to bring... is to make an order with this guy, Huno. And the second is if you if it is possible to place a bet with Scary. Those two things I've never figured out. I think they're impossible, but if someone knows, please put it in the comment. I'm really interested. Uh, now, uh, one mission for the set camp is to bring them a new member, and that is this guy, Dusty. But you cannot talk to him unless you talk to uh, the guy member in the set camp first, which I already did. So, yeah. Hi, I'm new here. How's things? Go away. I've been working my ass off in the mines for the last two weeks. And what for? Some sad lumps of ore is all I got. I had to spend most of it on food. I talked to Ball Parvis down there. He told me some interesting things about the sect camp. I think I'd better go there instead of slaving away for Gomez. You don't like it here? Why don't you just go then? Because I'm not quite sure what to expect there. I had a pal here. His name was Melvin. He headed off to the sect camp a week ago. But since then, I haven't heard of them. And as long as I don't get a message from him, I stay here. I was in the sect camp and met Melvin. And? What did he say? Apparently, he likes it more than getting harassed by the guards. Hey, man, he has all the fun for himself. I have to go there, but I'll never make it out of the camp. Really? Why not? The guards have found out that I want to leave. 
I guess I talk too much. I need at least 100 ore to bribe the guards. What if I gave you the 100 ore for the guards? You'd do that? Why? Well, let's say you aren't the only one who'd prefer you to hang around in the sect camp. You mean you want to come with me? I will go with you to the sect camp. Great, man. I'm ready. We can start as soon as you want. But don't forget, we need 100 ore for the guards. I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, let's take the south gate. The north gate is of no use. It's impossible to bribe the guards there. And perhaps you should see to the ore? I'm not very good at that kind of thing. Okay, let's move. Okay, now it's as simple as a pie, as I've heard it said. Uh, you just take it to the set camp, walk with him. Nothing too difficult, but I'm gonna save. You shouldn't believe everything. That wasn't very okay. We continue. People always talk. Come on, Dusty, Dusty old boy. I remember that they always had trouble getting him, getting him up this platform right here. He's kind of stupid, for an NPC at least. Yes, come on. Good boy. You see? Great. Stop! Where you think you're going with our friend? We're just going for a stroll. Here's 100 ore. Why oh, never saw anything? Yeah. All you saw was the ore, right? Come on, Dusty. I must not get too far away from him or I'm gonna lose him. Uh, where was I? Right, I talked about the advantages and the disadvantages of the camps. The new camp is pretty easy to join, but it doesn't matter to me right now because I'm ready to join any of the camps. I wanted to show you all the missions in chapter 1. So, you only need like, to do 3 tasks. The Mordrix ring to bring the 400 ore to Laris and to bring him the list from the old mine. As simple as that. Now, the, the old camp is probably the most interesting for the story because at one point you actually get to change camps you'll you'll get uh, and, uh, you'll see that when we get to that part so that's basically it and uh, in chapter 2 uh, the new camp uh, and the second camp have some extra missions that don't really affect the story uh, the old camp does not have that in the new camp you have to bring a message from the water to the fire mages and for the sect camp you need to bring some swamp wheat to Gomez and also uh, kill a couple of rogues that are producing swamp wheat on their own they're near to the new camp the old camp does not have an extra mission like that So that's probably it. Also in the old, and the, if you join old in the new camp you have a choice to become a magician if you want. Uh, in the second camp you, as I said, templars are like magicians and warriors so they are combined. But they have that major flaw about two-handed fighting. That's why I almost never joined them. He fell in the water, did he? Where is he? I wouldn't like to be in his shoes. Oh, come on! 
to watch what you tell them. Where are you, dusty old sock? Okay, I, I'm just gonna go to report to the guru. I'm gonna see if it's possible to do even if dusty is not around me. Same old story every time. Okay, so I can either A go looking for him or B complete the second mission that I have in this camp. And I think I'm just gonna go complete that mission and end the episode there. I'm gonna find Dusty and, and or I'm simply gonna load. And do it in the next episode. Here's the second mission. Here, Master, a modest present from your student. Hmm. So he falls asleep right now in front of his students. They're probably just praying, Oh, slow mighty sleeper, bring us back our master. Ah, don't worry, the bold lux here is going to wake up pretty soon. It's just the drug I gave him. Don't cry, little bitches. Come on. What was that? Thank you. In the name of the sleeper, I've had a vision. It was incredible. I saw that we would win a new brother, one who was not like those who came before him. He was doing something to us. There was a sword in his hand, and he was descending a wide flight of stairs. Then the vision ended. He looked very much like you. Who are you? What do you want? I'm just a modest servant of the sleeper. Go to Kor Kalom. He'll take care of you. Great. So now... I uh, think I'm not gonna be able to fight Dusty. Who knows where he is. He might even be dead. Hey! Disappear from my hut! Or I'll call the guards! Maybe he reappears now, I don't know. Something always goes wrong with this episode, doesn't it? Okay, you know what? I am obviously not able to find this guy, Dusty. So, I'm gonna do it in between episodes. It's very simple task. You just bring him over to that guru over there. Uh, that I talked to before. And he's... You just tell him I found a new, a new pupil for you or something like that, and that ends your task. Hey, and I don't think uh, I need to show you how to do it, so it doesn't even matter. Uh, anyway, in the next episode we are going to be, uh, we are going to be joining a camp and starting the actual story missions. And uh, I have three questions that I haven't been able to answer. So, if any of you guys can help me, write that in the commentary. First one is: Is it possible to place a bet with Scary? Second is to make: Is it possible to uh, place an order with Fudo? And the third is: Is it possible for someone to teach you two-handed sword fighting in the sack camp? Maybe. If anyone knows answers to any of these questions, please. Uh, post in the commentary. I will be very grateful. Goodbye.